What's going on everybody? My name is Patrick Ewing, the basketball player and soccer player. And today we have to pick Isaac up from school and we're gonna go on an epic adventure. Here's his school. What's going on, man? Not much. How was school? Yeah, it was all right. We went to the dumpsters. Again. Dumpsters, again? Yep. I figured. The other priest was coming down, so I stood in there. <laughs> it was not you. Really? Yeah, and then I was like, was confused. I was like, why? Wow. <laughs> but before we go to McDonald's and grab this amazing order. Oh, we got a puppy. Hey. Do you see the puppy? Hey, Bills, who's that? You see the puppy dog? Who's that? Gonna She's gonna jump out the window again. All right, Isaac's never had bang before. Are you ready to experience bang for the first time right, in your 72 it. years of life? You know, I've been thinking about it. Let's get it. The only decent one is this rainbow unicorn. So it looks like we're both gonna be in the rainbow uni. All right, so we're gonna get Isaac's first thoughts. What do you think? What do you think about the bang? Well, I think it, it just really makes me wanna. <laughs> So yeah, just a disclaimer, that's that's what bangs are gonna do to you. All right, so here we are at our star location of the day. We're gonna be going and we're gonna be grabbing the secret menu of the McDonald's. This is probably gonna be something that you guys aren't used to, something that you guys had no idea even existed, but I got the ultra deep down scoop of the deep dish pizza combo blend of basically the secret menu items that we have here at this McDonald's franchise establishment. Hey, what's the McDonald's are gonna get for you? Hi right, Diane, can I get one Coca-Cola cheeseburger, a uh, french fry burger bob combo blend, a uh, shish kebab coke burger, a uh, large burger drink, and uh, crap, what was the last thing? It was a uh, healthy Bales Yummies burger. And one healthy Bales Yummies burger. Thank you. All right, my fellow taco salamanders, without any further ado, let us munch. Isaac, you've experienced it. You've had the McDonald's secret menu. Well, I didn't even know McDonald's had a secret menu, but every time I'm back, I'm gonna have to get one of those delicious items. <laughs> I don't know. You want these? No. All right, we're home. Come on, Bess. Yo. What are you doing here? What are you doing here? <laughs> you're drinking all my soda? All right, we're gonna need another trick from you. That's what we do when you're around. Bez is like, yo, I want to see Sydney do a trick. So Sydney, you're going to have to come back here. You're going to have to do a Cornwallis backflip blend. Bez is pissing. Kick you. The phone's down. It's getting real now. It is official. Something is about to happen. All right, here we go. In three, six, 42, 11 and a half. Shoe nice. Oh my. Oh, bitch, what are you doing? The Bez is with her grandma. Check it out. The Bez is just chilling with her grandma, with her Isaac. And she's just having a good old time with a plus 10 puppy horsepower machine. <laughs> so Isaac just asked me to borrow one of my shirts. And <laughs> this is the one he chose. I like it. It looks good on you. Say bye, viewers. They're leaving. Bye. Bye. bye Thanks for the help. What? To get coffee? Okay. Bez is coming with you. Bye, babes. Bez, <laughs> come on. Let's go. Bez, come here. Bez loves her grandma. Say bye. Bye, babes. You're a good girl, babes. All right, you guys. I hope you enjoyed that. I thought it was pretty fun. What do you think, Bez? 
The Bez loved it. The Blackie Sant, he loved it. You like a Blackie Sant? Yeah, he loved it. Look at that. Look at that guy. When am I gonna get another dog? When am I gonna get the bears a friend? And the bears, she wants a friend. She deserves a friend. And she needs somebody to play with. She's got some friends over there, but I guess they don't really play because they can't go past the electric fence. And if they go past the fence or if Bales goes over the fence to go play with them, they'll get shocked for some reason. That's what the owner said. So I guess they're out of the question. So anyways, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to get a fence basically put up around the backyard. I think I want to grow some more of those trees right across here and then put a fence in front of it. So basically all you see is the fence and then eventually those trees will grow up tall over the fence so I won't have to bother seeing them. Not that I don't like them, but you know, we need our privacy. We need our backyard privacy. So what I have to do first is I have to clear out all this stuff right here. And there's a lot of stuff and then I want to cut down this tree. This is a massive tree and that's going to be a project, but Isaac and I are probably going to be doing it and we're gonna be recording the whole thing and that's what's gonna be coming up soon, just like yard work and stuff. Stuff that I have to do before I get another dog because the bale, she personally doesn't care about being back here. Like she'll only be back here if I'm back here. But if I get another dog, maybe he'll wanna be back here. Maybe he'll wanna spend time outside. So obviously, you know, I'm not gonna be going for six walks a day if I'm having a busy day filming or going somewhere. So some of the time they're just gonna to have to come back here. All right, yep, see like as soon as I start walking in, the bells is like, yo, we're going inside. I get to go to bed. I get to go to sleep. She has no interest in being out there alone, which is kind of an honor. Like, it's kind of funny. The bells would never run away from me. Like, you guys saw she jumped out the window. It's not like she jumped out the window and darted and got lost. And she jumped out the window and tried to get to me. So, it makes me feel good. You know, I know that the bells loves me. And I love the bells. The bells' head is like a light bulb. That means she has an idea all the time, or she is an idea, which is good. It's an honor. Bez, you're an idea. Anyways, look at. My mom gave me these presents. They're the dual boy cocky boys. So the bed's gonna jump up. She's gonna kind of lay down like that. She's gonna have the dual boy cockies right there. Keeping her company, keeping her safe. And if she ever wants to venture off away from the couch, follow me. She's got this one, which is always on my noggin to keep her in tip top shape. Or she can just come down the hallway. Just get a little bit of cocky boy action right here. And she'll just be good to go. And basically no matter where she is, she'll be safe. She'll be good to go. She'll be on a walk with me. She'll have this one. And, and she's just got cocky boys for life. You know, all around her, keeping her safe, protecting her. And forever we can just pretend we're gonna end the video on the cocky boy and then we end up going to the license plate. You guys know the drill. So here we got the office. The office is a mess, but I just set up my computer. There it is, that's the computer. Bez, what do you think? Do you like your computer? She loves it. She plays on it all the time, look at her. She's like, yup, I know what that is, it's my computer. And so that's pretty much it for updates for now. The Bez is just enjoying her life, you know? She's just kinda like a retired old man. We're gonna go party, okay? Okay? Okay, go. Go, Bez, go. Go, Bez, go. The Bez got a butt. The Bez got a butt in your face. So we're gonna be taking the veils to her new special place where from now on, she's gonna be going on some very special walks. I mean, not like a super duper ultra special extreme special walk, but you know, like the second or third, fourth point two five closest thing to that, which is this beautiful park. Well, there's a rainbow. Can you guys see the rainbow? So the Bales used to love going to the park in California and walking around the lake. Now this lake right here is more like a little pond boy but it's fairly close, you know? It's like a little lake, you can walk around it, there's water, and the good thing about it is, there's also a big walkway that goes all the way around this entire park way back there, and it ends up being about the exact same length as the lake where we were living in California. So you know, whenever we feel like going on a special walk and not just walking around by where I live, this is where we're gonna be going. So proud of you. You didn't get the squirrel though. I'm kind of glad you didn't, Bez. What would you do if you caught the squirrel? Would you eat it? How are you, Mrs. Kath? Everybody's been asking about the cat. They're like, when are you gonna start riding the cat, making the club video? We got the lawnmower. Maybe I should just take the lawnmower out if I'm not gonna ride the cat. Or you know what, we got my vacuum cleaner. I could take that out, I could take that thing out, which I've been really wanting to do, but I made that thing and it never really worked out. So I'm thinking about making some club channel videos. It's just, I really was waiting for this to get fixed and I'm still waiting for monster fairings to send me this fairing, they said they would. So I'm taking them up on their word. It's gonna show up at my doorstep, on my front stoop. But other than that, that is where we are gonna end today's video. I really appreciate you guys watching me gallop my way through this video today. 
And with the bales, the bales have been a big helper today. She helped me eat all those cheeseburgers. Let me know what you thought about the McDonald's secret menu. If you're gonna go there yourself, you're gonna order it. And if you do go ahead and order it, make sure you send me a video on Instagram so I can laugh my way to the next century where I'll be 752 years old. And with that, the Bales and I wanna thank you so much for watching. And we will see you on the cocky boy number 2.0. <gasps>